facing Dark Pit versus Kirby. Very interesting first matchup. Man, yeah, that's a... I'm going to be honest, I forgot that Dark Pit was in the game. <laughs> I mean, it's like you said that and I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> like, what's a Dark Pit? Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah. Dark Pit, new to this game. Um, new to the Snap Pit to this game. But here, it's pretty much, it's, so, you know Pit, it's pretty much the same character. Yeah. They were the same. Uh, same sort of deal as Smash 4, where it's Pit, but with less maneuverable arrows and a different angle on side B. Yeah, same. Okay. Do you know if there have been any other, like, additional changes past that? Um, I think they've gotten better... Combo tools. I know they can do like drag down there, drag up, drag down up there, and go like up there. They have a gotcha. Bunch, they have a bunch more kill points they can drag down. Um, side B still killing great dumb early. <laughs> sure. And I'm sure it still has the super armor on. Oh yeah, for sure. That's super armor. <laughs> but um, you know, Aerith said kind of taking control of this first stock, but he got a, almost a little bit overzealous off stage there, and he's lost. Uh, his all, all of the jumps actually. He almost got gimped, but... Mm -hmm. I'm curious how much uh, Kirby being short is going to mess with Dark Pit's lack of like arrow maneuverability, because yeah. Normal Pit could just aim them down. I don't think Dark Pit can pass a certain range. Oh my goodness, Ariset. Wow, yeah. Shot. But, oh my gosh, that dash attack almost killed. That's crazy. Yeah. I think he's a super light. <laughs> yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, this is uh, exactly where the arrow limitations are going to come into play. When you knock them off stage, it's so much harder to harass with them. <laughs> Back air. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> See ya. That, yeah, that sent in a direction. That was... Like, I'm pretty sure that was not correct DI, but that was so fast, I don't blame Arisef for yeah. that at all. Yeah, I was, that, that, shot, that shocked me a little bit. I was not expecting him to freaking fly to the other side the next stage, but... Yeah, for sure. And yeah, that uh, that pit back air is like, it's really strong. It's kind of surprisingly so. Wow, man. I assumed that, that move was done. <laughs> uh, oh, do you know if, uh, I guess he doesn't need it as much. But that side B in this game, does it put him in hard fall afterwards? Uh, I don't I, think so, dark, right? Dark pit? Yeah. Uh, no, it does not put him in Okay, if I remember right in Smash 4, it didn't put him into hard fall there either, but it had like this game's air dodge ending lag on it, so it was still basically a self destruct. Yeah. In this game, uh, Pit and Dark Pit both have the, the blessing to jump B out of there. The recoveries, but man, Ariset's just kind of putting in the work right now. Gotcha. Yeah, holy smokes. The game was even for the second stop, and then Ariset just kind of pulled away with, you know, with just pulling out all the buttons of combos. Yeah, this, I think that's kind of been how this has been going, is like in neutral and stuff, things have been very close. Um, Kirby's just been hitting for more damage each time. Wow, good push back with the older. And I mean, of course, off stage, Kirby's got to be the scarier of the two. Yeah. Get down air spike, get down B, get in air. Air is really good, back air is really good. I am curious as to why um, B picks Dark Pit over Normal Pit. I assume it's just like preferred character type deal. Uh, I'd, I would be curious if there's like a tactical reason for it though. Maybe they like the, the, the off stage arrows and how they go really yeah. inside, but. True, true. I know that uh, back in the day, bees would pull out Dark Pit actually, and specifically went Dark Pit because they liked the ending theme, like the victory theme. That's fair. <laughs> hey, whatever reason, whatever reason you pick your character, you pick it. Mm -hmm. uh, but Eric said picking it, or taking the first game in this first and the third round of the Swiss bracket, but. Never know, Beep could make the comeback with the Dark Pit. Yep. Yeah, that like that didn't look undoable. That just really came down to like I guess just 
Kirby is pretty slow off stage, so you have to be able to pressure him, and it didn't look like Vee was able to get quite enough off of those situations. Yeah. It... I think it might be some matchup inexperience in terms of, like, how B plays that matchup, because I, because I don't think he was ready to do it. With those combos, the offstage game. It, it was just very, very... I, I felt like B just wasn't ex or like prepared or expecting it. Mm -hmm. it could make the, they could make the comeback, and I think they might. But I think... There might be some characters, which maybe um, never know. Yeah, I'm not sure. They're definitely sitting in character select. Yeah, yeah, I mean, let me hop over to. Uh... Right, well, it looks like we're going to FD for this next game. Hmm. Hmm. That's an interesting pick. No, no platforms means that it's just going to be straight neutral and. Like you said earlier, the neutral was super even. It's just who can, I guess, get the confirms to take the stocks. It's gonna be pretty, 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 pretty interesting. Mm -hmm. Oh, looks like they two, did swap like one, player sides. Go! They also swapped <laughs> Purple and red. I, mean, I guess that's, that's for the stages. Yeah, exactly. Well planned. I think I think Beep has the right idea using using this stage because Kirby likes to come in with a lot of jumps and a lot of dark pitch aerials are very big. They're the very big. So it covers Yeah, it's kinda of surprisingly so. Wait, how do the pits uh nares work in this game? Is it anything like Palutena's? Or um, is it like four where there was no uh dragon on it at all? No, there's some dragons. There's um Oh wow, yeah. yeah. Oh, that was good. Nice tag. That was real good. Um, in this game, yeah, hits and airs are like they're kind of their own thing. They can do drag and stuff. They can have to send. They can send like pretty far out if they can hit the full thing. Gotcha. Yeah. Combo from like there. Dude, that was some really nice movement by Beep. Um, successfully using Smash Ultimate Dash Dancing to bait something out and come back in with, uh, I believe it was a jab, but like, the jab's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, it's getting a little dicey right here. Eris is trying to read this, the air dodge right there. But, yeah, it looked like he had the read, just not the timing on yeah. it. Beep managed to delay just a little bit extra. Mm -hmm. But Eris said, the dash attack? I think the dash attack and force smash would have Um. Yeah, the dash attack didn't kill. I didn't see what actually did. Definitely set up for it. Oh boy, and here comes the Kirby combos. Oh. Never mind, DIing out. Yes. I think that's the, that's the correct way to get stuff. Taking less. And that'll do it. Yep. Yeah, uh, one of the hard things for the pits for sure is like they don't have kill confirms really. So, you know. You gotta find a raw hit. It's kind of the Mario problem, right? Yeah, exactly. We're looking for a force match like that here. Looking for a big raw hit, nothing to really confirm. Really oh man, but while we're talking about uh, Beep's Dark, wow, what a down smash! Um, oh my gosh, I can't read the name. Yeah, Arisath, right. Uh, Arisath has been just tearing him up combo wise. Mm -hmm. At about double the percentage. What an interaction. Yeah. Uh... Uh, I guess the forward momentum countered out the pushback, and so it left him right in punish range. Oh my goodness, good read on the, on the dash attack. Uh, Screen the roll out. Yeah, just call it out, get the kill. Get stuff there. Oh, he waited for the air dodge. That was real smart. His timing was just slightly off. It's really interesting to see how he's using these uh, orbiters for, like, I don't know what to call it besides counter spacing. Yeah. But, like, not in the normal way. He's definitely doing a lot of interesting stuff for me. But I don't think this is this is a lot even than it I think is entailing. It's just it's a whole lot of like Kirby does a little bit extra combo damage and has a little bit safer kill moves to throw out. Yeah. That seems to be like the rest of it is pretty even. Ooh, he's gotta be careful. Uh oh. That's, that's, that's it. Yep, yep. Unfortunate. 
Uh, also, I guess we do confirm that Scythe B on whip is uh, basically an SD. Yeah, I, I mean, you can up B back, I think, if you use your jumps. <laughs> Mm -hmm. But I mean, you saw how much uh, yeah, yeah. recovery that had. That was done from above the stage, so. Yeah, it, it, yeah, it was just tough all around there for uh, uh, Beeb there. But it was a good try. Good stuff there.